do back with another match day vlog. This time it's Bristol City away. But this time it's in the FA Cup. It's minor Luke's third time going there. Uh, the twice we've been there before was a 1-0 win uh, last season thanks to a goal from Joel Perot and then the most recent one was a one all draw thanks to a late equaliser from Olivier and Cham but um, yeah it's going to be a different one because it's the FA Cup hope we can progress because I really like the trophy but um, yeah as I say it's going to be a different one hopefully some of the youngsters get given a chance but um, I'll catch up to you when I'm with Luke and the boys and see what they think ahead of the game yeah, so I've got uh, Ben Lee's uh, Bristol City fan. How, yeah. how are you doing, mate? Not too bad, mate, you said? I am doing very good, thanks. Uh, yeah, what, what are your thoughts going into this game, then? Honestly, the FA Cup's thrown around anything that could go either way. You've obviously sold out, so you've got some money out today. Anything that I've had really yeah. We've already seen loads of upsets yesterday. Yeah, sure. Oh, yeah, we'll just go fix some of this game. I'll go to um, Bristol City. And Swansea not doing too well in the beginning of the week, so he's picked up form. So it wouldn't surprise me if both teams put out and they were very short sure side. Right, Luke, KFC rap review this time. Dry January, no pints. I don't know if you're doing it, but I see it. Yeah, um, I never drink January, so <laughs> e easy win for me, though. Yeah, uh, what, what have you got? I've got, I've got a barbecue and twister wrap, <laughs> proper scram. Already eat most of it, but I'll be there. Yes, nice salad in there, nice red cabbage, nice lettuce. Barbecue sauce, chicken, that, but. Oh, yeah, I'll give it, um, give it an 8 out of 10. Right, so here are the team team lineup. Uh, Stephen Bender, Joel Atibodia, Nathan Wood, Ben Cabango, Ryan Manning, Jay Fulton, Matt Grimes, Joe Allen, Ollie Cooper, Liam Cullen, and Joel Perot. So only one change, but who's got the bench? On the bench, we've got Andy Fisher, Harry Darling, Olivia Cham, Nathaniel Bata on the bench, Luke Handel, Kyle Norton, Mark Sorimilla, Cameron Congreve, and Joe Cotterill. Yeah. Not a bad team. It's alright. <laughs> Um, 2 1, Wood and Callum, fine one for Bristol City. 1 0 Swans win, he's been enjoying his travels recently, Liam Cullen. Right, time to make the prediction. It's going to be a tough game, but I'm going to say Bristol City 1, Swans 2, and I'm going to Harry Darr and Joel Perot and Andreas Hyde on one way. Um, I'll go for a 3 1 Swans when I'm feeling confident. Uh, both teams are in very bad form in the league, but I think. We can, I know three one swans. I think Joe Pro will get a brace. I think Liam Cullen will get a goal as well. And I, I think Andreas Ryan will score for Bristol.
Bristol City nil, Swansea City one. What are your thoughts on that so far? Um, I think overall, I think we have been the better side so today. Yeah, uh, yeah, right. Yeah, we've created a lot of chances going forward and that, and I think we have been the better side. Yeah, what are your thoughts on the half? Oh, amazing. Amazing half first half. We're playing fluid football. Absolutely amazing. Nothing I've ever seen before in my life. Yeah, do you record win this game? Yeah, 100%. Yeah, we're seeing it through. 3-0, 3-0. Liam Cameron, he wins 100 quid. Yeah, right. Come on, <laughs> yeah, that's there for you. Um, yeah, it's been a really good half so far. We have been the best side. I, I do see us winning this game, like, you know, two or three. I, I, I can stick with three one. I think they will get a goal from somewhere. But yeah, overall, I'd say we've been the best side. And uh, yeah, I see a Swans three one written all over it. Yeah, I agree. We've been the best side. You know, started early, but the intensity has kind of died down since the goal. But I think we'll still be on top. We have enough to win this game, but we have been the best side. So, you know, we got off the top of the bench, so hopefully we can you know, bring them on and see how the game and hopefully get uh, a couple more goals. Right, Curtis, half time, what are you thinking so far? Oh, I think we've been a better team. We dominate possession. Joel Perot, such an easy goal for him because it was a gift at the back. And Bristol City just started a bit stronger start. Calvin Smith free kick firing it over the bar. But other than that, we've been a better team first half. Yeah. Just... Substitution. The band has gone off. Harry Darling has come on. And Luke Kendall's come on as well. Chances going forward. Uh, I pressed out a few in the second half. Fred Lee to them. You know, they got a good goal, but um, yeah, in the end, I think, 
that point it's probably fair for both teams. You know, uh, now we've got a replay at our stadium, which you know I think we will be confident playing at home than that. So I think we will win at home on the replay, but to be fair, Bristol gave us a good game in the second half. And uh, yeah, our, our tactics our tactics is great good enough in the set in second half. Yeah, we started off the game so brightly, I thought we'd finish it off, but we kind of sat back second half in the game, but you know, a replay now at home, it's not the end of the world, we didn't lose. So you know, we're still in the cup, but yeah, obviously a massive thanks for watching this. We'll be back next Friday for our match preview there, the Sunday anyway. So soon for that, and thanks for watching.